patient safety in clinical trials. The most important member of any clinical trial team is you, the patient. So important that efforts to protect your safety begin even before the trial itself does. A clinical trial in the U.S. may only enroll patients after its protocol is approved by a group called an Institutional Review Board, or IRB. IRB members include scientists, as well as nurses, advocates, and others. Their job is to monitor the clinical trials and protect participant safety. The protocol describes the study's goals and methods and outlines how the participant safety will be ensured. IRB members review the protocol to make sure that the risk of harms is as low as possible and that any potential harms are a reasonable part of the research study. Another important safety step is the informed consent process. Before you can join a trial, the research team will fully discuss the trial with you. If you decide to join, you will sign an informed consent form to confirm that you understand what's involved. You are encouraged to ask questions at any point before or after joining a study. And of course, you may always choose to leave the study. It's completely up to you. Once a study begins, its scientific progress and the safety of its participants are regularly monitored. The study may be changed or even stopped to ensure the patient's safety. Clinical trial participants are a vital part of cancer research. Better cancer care tomorrow depends on what we learn from clinical trials today. For more on how your safety is protected on clinical trials, visit the National Cancer Institute's website at cancer.gov slash patient safety. And thank you. U.S. Departments of Health and Human Services. National Institutes of Health. National Cancer Institute. Cancer.gov. 1-800-4-CANCER. Produced September 2017.